Hello everybody. Today I'm going to show you how to create a butterfly chart using Tableau Desktop. So let's try to understand a butterfly chart. A butterfly chart shows comparison of two associated measures side by side. It displays two bar charts on either side of the same y-axis. This chart is also known as diverging bar chart or tornado chart. Let's analyze this butterfly chart that displays comparison of profit and budget profit for each state. The data we are using today is from the sample coffee chain data source. We have the state dimension on the x-axis and the profit and budget profit measures on the y-axis. We have profit on the left-hand side and budget profit on the right-hand side of the data labels. To identify two measures, we're using two different color palettes. Using this view, you can easily compare profit and budget profit for each state. For example, California has generated profit around 31 Ks, whereas budget profit is around 28 K. Now let's see how to create this visualization. Let me create a new sheet for this visualization. Drag and drop the state dimension to rows. Then place the profit and budget profit measures to columns. We want to display these bars side by side. To do this, right click the profit axis and select edit axis. This opens the edit axis window. From this window, select the reverse scale checkbox and then click on OK. We are almost close to our required chart. Now let's display the state labels between the two columns. To achieve this, we need to create a calculated field. Name this field as zero axis and enter the value as zero. Click on OK to close the editor. From the list of measures, drag and drop the calculation we just created onto the columns between the two existing measures. Click on zero axis pill and place the state dimension to the label property. Let's hide the previous state header and the axis headers. Let's do a bit of formatting now. Go to the format menu and select line. For sheet, set the zero lines and axis ticks options to none. For columns, set grid lines to none. Close the format pane. Once again, select the zero axis pill and change the mark type to text using the marks card. Let's add color encoding to our view. To achieve this, select the profit pill, hold the control key and drag and drop it to color. Repeat the same steps for budget profit pill as well. Right now both the colors are same, so let's change the color for the budget profit pill using the color property. Now let's enable the data labels using the marks card. With that, our butterfly chart is ready. We hope you've learned how to implement butterfly charts and you'll be able to do it on your own at your workplace. Thank you for watching this video. This video is brought to you by Nice Software Solutions.